Christ Wood here. Another day of being lived through and broadcasted through from remote Nero monitoring and Nero link cochlear attachments from William Billy Waldridge, OPP Spencer Mills's possible wife. 455, 456 days of being injured and tortured brain damage, being having my brain fried out of my head, having another person live through me and not in a mental illness way, not in a schizophrenic way, but in it from tech. All can be proven. I have AI in me. I have nanotech, Neuralink cochlear attachment with William Billy Waldridge illegally, unconsensually, of course. They took out his prisoner tracking. They put it into me for this identity. Theft, identity change, crime on me. William Billy Waldridge is an informant. He is psychotic. He is delusional. He is a stalker. He is a sex offender. He is a human sex trade slavery trafficker. He is a drug trafficker. He is highly delusional, highly psychotic. And he is a serial killer and possible wife to once more, again, Spencer Mills, OPP 14716, guilty of sexual assault on me as well. Staff Sergeant William Billy Wildred used to stalk children for the chief who is now gone. Shannon Cork laughs in people's faces over William Billy Wildred's arrest when here for illegal street theater gang stalking bullshit to make me try to make me look and seem more than what I'm not hoping for a mental health hold hoping for institutionalized hoping for jail hoping for whatever no criminal record no psychological history with any doctors or hospitals no brain problems prior to August of 2019 when this all started I do now. No surgeries prior to or after 20 or August of 2019. All can be proven. Lies to discredit, cover ups, medical file falsifications, CASCAN pictures conveniently disappearing, um, medical refusals for treatment at Lennox and Addington Hospital, Dr. V, Dr. Gregory, Dr. Barton. 455, 456 days of this, I am being changed mentally and physically by a psychotic, so OPP can get out of crimes. There was a drug bust this morning, I believe there was a drug bust, it was out back of my house. And I hope that the people involved are still alive by the end of the day. If they had anything to do with Spencer Mills, they just might find themselves on the same end of the stick that I am on because of me speaking of OPP crimes, but with them, they actually could be a criminal thing. It could have been a drug bust, whatever the case may be. I don't know. But I'm afraid for their lives that something may happen to whoever these people are involved. So, Christ would love all, hate none, take this serious. Almost four, well, 455, 456 days of this, I feel nothing in my head, nothing in my face, only electricity and being broadcasted through by a psychotic, untouchable, unarrestable, being hidden, being protected, William Billy Wooldridge by OPP. Mental health worker involved, XOPP Robert Lucas, Staff Sergeant, Chief who is now gone, Shannon Cork, Spencer Mills 14716, and William Billy Wooldridge, along with Dr. V, medical file falsifier, Dr. Gregory, refused a medical treatment and attention on me, Dr. Barton, Lennox and Annington Hospital, you were also guilty of helping cover this crime up on me, or you are involved. William Billy Wooldridge is also guilty of using remote neuromonitoring on my mother.
broadcasting through her cause an EMFs and radiation, which caused cancer. He is guilty of attempted murder on an elderly as well. Christ would love all, hate none.